Get him out of the current. Get him out of the current. Today we're going to be fishing a creek that we've fished quite a few times over the years. We've got some special guests in this video. Our wives will be joining us fishing. The creek has a lot of steep cliffs, a lot of hiking, so I hope the wives know what they signed up for. I'm sorry, we're doing what now? It's late May, there's lots of spring runoff, so we've got a lot of water moving down the creek. All this water is going to be pushing a lot of food through the system, so we're hoping that that makes the fish pretty active. Tell us a little bit about what you're using today, Jordan. <clears throat> Worms, a couple weights. Doesn't seem to want it until I retrieve it really slow and then I just kind of use it. Oh, come on. I gotta let him take it more. Oh, he swiped at it. Yeah. It's a little too far away from me now. Kind of bait comes by, he swims out and takes a swipe at it. But he's just, he's got commitment issues, is a real problem. Got him. Oh! I think he took your bait. guys, I was not expecting to catch a fish that big out of this creek. Uh, we fished this creek a fair amount and we caught lots of fish in here and we knew there was always a chance to catch a fish that big because we had heard that there were some larger fish in here and definitely enough, you know, aquatic life to support a, a fish that big. But uh, yeah, super happy with that fish. Fish is probably 18 inches or so and, and fought pretty good on that ultralight uh, set up even though I didn't have to fight him very long. He's in a pretty small pool, but super cool fish wild rainbow Awesome. Let's see if we can get another
right, Jordan's hooked up here. All right, show us that brownie, Jordan. Oh, nope. Oh, it's too fast. Slips through his finger. Same place I've been fishing forever, and I recut his big fist, so I thought, well, I'll go throw in that hole. Should have stayed where I was, because that's where I ended up catching it. So. Nice, fishing's starting to heat up a little bit, eh? A little bit. This is how I die right here, looking in the viewfinder. Get him out of the current. Get him out of the current. I casted out kind of by the fast moving water and kind of just let it drift into this little pocket by a rock and just let it sit there. And I knew there had to be a fish in there. And lo and behold, there was a fish. Hey guys, thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, we got into some fish, got into some nice fish. Overall, it was a great few days uh, getting away, getting up to the mountains, um, getting some fishing in. Uh, and if you like seeing a guy fish in board shorts and hiking boots, this was absolutely the video for you. Glad you enjoyed it. And if you want to replicate my highly classy look of board shorts and hiking boots, or any of the other gear we used in this video, check out the links in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, 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 oh,